Now I'm programmed the FPGA board with a register demo though. And with the uh, control of the Arduino connected to the different register lines as we can see on, on this schematic, we have the chip select, the read select, read and write and the data lines. I'm able to write to the FPGA registers using the Arduino and the IDE or some other code. Currently I've made another uh, code using the software I made to communicate with the Arduino and we see here set uh, NCS and RS and read, write and write the data clear and uh, write and uh, RS and uh, write the data and then we end with selecting chip select. So if I start this application, oh, let me say that the code inside this FPGA has some registers. It has got a register for the LEDs, it's got a register for the different numbers here on the 7 segment, so I can control them uh, each and the FPGA takes care of the uh, multiplexing. So let's start the uh, application. Here I have a, I made a simple application where I can turn on the LEDs like if we click this one and this one you'll see that down here they turn on and that not that's not the same as before because the Arduino sends the complete register uh, control commands to the FPGA now for example if I write up here one two three four and click send we'll see that one two three four appears on the seven segment I can also write um, A B C D uh, sorry I have to do it in capital A B C D and it will appear I have I've also made a simple clock which is using the computer's clock and then it just sends the clock to the uh, to the FPGA using the registers so if I click here we'll say 1426 and then every time every second it writes to the register also to turn on the dot and that's what we can see over here also the RX data line is toggling every second so that's probably it. It's a simple register demo made in VHDL. TKJ Production.